Hi, today we'll try to see a question of algebra in the terms of number system. We have an equation x square plus 3y square equal to 3, 4, 5, 6, 2, 6. At a first glance, it seems a question of algebra, but believe me, it is a question of number system. If you have any equation in this term like x square plus my square equal to something, we just need to identify what is the m. Here m is 3, so we have to check remainders for the 3. It's a question of remainders. We know when x is divided by 3, say when x divided by 3, the remainders are either 0, 1 or 2. Fine. So what would be the value of x square divided by 3? x divided by 3 is a 0, so x square gives 0. For this, this is a 1. For 2, the x square becomes 4, so the remainder is 1. Hope it is clear. So we can say when this x square divided by 3, y3 because the coefficient is 3, gives remainder 0 and 1 on. Hope it is perfectly fine. When this number divided by 3, we obviously say the remainder would be 0 in any case because it is a multiple of 3. Here we have a plus sign. So we have two cases. 0 plus 0 is 0. 1 plus 0 is 1. So when the LHS divided by 3, remainder would be either 0 or 1. We cannot get any other remainder. Check the remainder for the RHS when divided by 3. When we divide this number by 3, our remainder is so we can say for any integral value of x and y, we cannot get LHS equal to RHS since we cannot equate two different remainders. So this is a question of number system. When we can get few equal values, then we convert it into algebra, use number system again and get the answer. I hope it is clear to you. When you have any question in any examination is like x square plus m y square is something. First check with the remainder of by m. Most of the time they won't match. If they match, convert the question into algebra and solve it further. I hope it is clear. If you have any doubt, feel free to ping me either on this video thread or on YouTube. Okay. Thanks and happy learning. Bye.